Howdy folks, today we're back in the camper. We're gonna use our fluke meter and we're gonna talk about how to check your converter, your entire power system in the camper. Keep tuned, it's simple, you're gonna love this. Alrighty folks, so we're all set up here to test our 12 volt power converter in the camper. This system turns short power 120 volt into 12 volt power that many of the things in the camper can use like lights or a furnace or fans because most of those run off a of 12 volt battery power. This camper doesn't have its own battery. So what I did is I took this battery here out of my garden tractor, which works the same, and I hooked it up to the 12 volt lugs on the distribution panel for the DC side, direct current. So as you can see here on our meter, the battery has 12.5 volts. This is a fully charged battery. And right now it is not being charged by the power converter. And how this works, this simple test, is we have our leads for our fluke meter connected to our battery. And when I turn on the main breaker for the camper, that will allow shore power into the power converter. And when that is on, it'll charge the battery and it'll also run any lights, fans, or a furnace in the camper when you need it. Also, the water pump runs off a of 12 volt in most uh, campers so without further ado if you watch the meter here it's at 12.5 volts and when I flip on the breaker it's gonna go up to almost 14 volts which is charging and then if you let it go for a while it'll actually start to decrease because the battery is fully charged so I'm gonna demonstrate that here the converter is now on and as you can see, we're up to 13 volts and it is still climbing. Our battery is charging. It's still climbing, we're at 12.9 or 13.97 volts approximately. It'll fluctuate just a little bit, but it's holding solid here for the moment as you can see. It's actually going to go down a little bit because it's realizing the battery doesn't need so much because the battery is almost full. And that there is how we test the 12 volt converter on the camper. And that'll run our lights such as our LED lights that were in our last video that we installed. So thanks for watching, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and if you'd like to see more, keep tuned because there's lots more RV videos coming up. Also, check down below for a link on how to get your own fluke meter.